Look what's turned up in merry old England and the rest of the UK. It's the battle packs for Warfighter from the uh, first Kickstarter. Let's crack a couple open. Hello and welcome to another video from me, Rough Swordsman Wargamer. Yes, they finally arrived. The battle packs from Wave 1 are here in the UK now. So I thought it might be fun to open two or three and see what they're all about. So for this video, I thought we'd look at uh, Mokra and the Battle of Iwo Jima. So... These two are a set. Cavalry Forward. This Warfighter World War II expansion adds 56 cards to your loadout. No special rules needed. This is a standalone battle pack. You must have, of course, the Warfighter World War II European Core Games action cards. Otherwise it won't work. And they're both designed by, or created by David Makin. So we'll see what this is all about. Right, it's expansion number 47, Battle of Mokra, 1939. What do we get in this deck? In no particular order, I've sorted them all out to the side so we can show you them a bit easier. And the first one I've got here is the Polish weapon cards. And they're all 1939 or before, of course, because that's when the battle happened. So machine guns tripod whoops and those familiar with warfighter of course will know what all these cards are about pistol grenade stabby thing and a slashy thing whoops the saber Next thing, soldier cards. Now all these, they're running about, or riding about on horses. Charging at uh, panzers, no doubt. There we go. But also, we've got, this is new for me, I don't own any vehicles for this uh, Warfighter. A couple of vehicle cards. Look at that. So what we've got next. Ooh, German, German elites as well. Pens of one. Two. The beloved sniper team. Small truck. Ambushes. Command Panzer One. Motorcycle with a light machine gun. Motorcyclist. There we are. Now I assume with these battle packs you just sort them into their piles and just use this. I think you can also, if you want, just incorporate them into the whole into your whole collection of Warfighter cards. And we have a couple of these. 
one equipment, one skill. The equipment is the Cavalry Horse. You may perform a move each soldier turn without spending an action. Gives you extra loadout and you can gallop along. And the skill, ignore the first suppress you suffer each turn. That's a goodie. Also got a, an event and a service record. There's the event for Mokra. And an event card. Thinking about it, there's only one event card in this battle pack, so I assume you just add this and get your event card deck out and use that as per normal. Otherwise you'd only have one event. And there are specific location cards. Open woods. There we go. So we'd use these. Boggy woods. Isolated farm. Coppiced woods. Row of houses. Wasteland. There's loads. Barn. So you just have these out. If you're playing this sprouting crop plowed field village road open road and deep woods objective cards Blitzkrieg 1939. Screen. Don't let them through. Delay. And last but not least, we've got the mission cards. Use World War II European action cards. Blitzkrieg, 1939, screen, without delay, and with alacrity, nearly couldn't say that, or alacrity. And there we are, that is what's in Battle Pack, Mokra, number one, let's do the same for number two. Part two of the Mokra is the other way round, because this time you play the Germans. So a few more German soldiers. We've got a couple of player soldiers and a couple of non-player soldiers. And to go with that, some more German weapons. MG34, MG34 Stroke 42, Tripod, MP38, ninety eight k Rifle, Bayonet, the old uh, stick grenade there, and the Luger. Also some German vehicle cards. Ghost motorcycle. Another motorcycle squad lead foot. And a Pathfinder motorcycle. And fighting them. Some Polish elite. Couple of skirmishers. Mounted anti-tank rifle. Okay. <laughs> cool. Dug in. Dug in. Oh, and another one. Couple of cavalry. And as always, the beloved sniper. Machine gun cart, machine gun team, light field gun, T-34, 
TKS, TK3, gun carriage, and another one, rear gun carriage. There we are. There is equipment and service records for this, and there we are, this is the German side. And of course, a motorcycle as equipment. A couple of skill cards, hip shooter, and gunman. I think you can just add these into your, into your existing skill cards. I would have thought. Gives you more choice. Here we've got some location cars this time. German. Wooden church. Rutted woods. Long village. Forest trail. Steep sided stream. Wooded rise. Embankment. So loads. Loads of locations. That's good. Underpass. <laughs> Drainage ditch. Bog. Dense wood. Cleared fields and forest clearing. So a goodly, goodly amount of locations there. Objectives. Resupply, storm the farm. You can take out the gun and seize the crossroads. And lastly, some mission cards. Use World War II European action cards. Recon in force, scouts. Patrol the perimeter and clear the hostiles. And there we are. Those oh, are the two Mokra decks, one from the point of view of the Poles, one from the point of view of the Germans. Lastly, Iwo Jima. So here we are, Iwo Jima. Hit the beach. And this one's created by Benjamin Chi. Hope I pronounced that right, Benjamin. So, once again, I've sorted them out and we'll show what's in this deck. American soldier cards. Marines, Goldsmith, player soldier. Giacchino, excuse my pronunciation. Colvin. MPS Bernstein, Shaw, Beltrami. So again, you could use these or just add them to your other Marines and you've got more of a choice for your mission in Iwo Jima. There we go. A weapon card, the M3. And here we are, some more Japan Elites. Again, either use these as is in a little uh, pile or add them to your Elite Hostile deck. Close range duo. Another one there. Mind you, it does say Iwo Jima. Maybe, maybe you should keep these separate. They're specific enemies for this specific battle. Although, you do what you want. Commanders. Dutiful soldiers. And they're entrenched. A couple of those. And that's a huge squad. Machine gun crew, 
observer. A couple of those and some spotters. Oops, and some spotters. Equipment card. Booby trap. Some skill cards this time. Fortify. I'm pretty sure you can add these to your skills and just use your, your whole deck of skills. Makes sense. Or keep these completely separate and play them as is. And some war records. Battle of Saipan. Rattle Canal. Bougainville campaign. Right. And specific location cards for Iwo Jima. Rocky Passage. Subterranean East. Subterrain. So I read that wrong. Subterrain West. Beg your put. East and West. Hidden Passage. T Junction. Hmm. Oh, the War Room. Civilian Quarters. Outer Grotto. Inner Grotto. Sick Bay. Crew quarters and underground shrine. So lovely lots of locations there. Objectives. Root them out. Beheading the snake. The mountain falls. Blood and obsidian. Broken pincers. And raising the flag. And to go with those, the mission cards, and of course, use the World War II Pacific action cards. Do as we say. Whispers of steel. Into the labyrinth. The bitter path. Oh, raining devastation. And go the distance. So there we are. That's the Iwo Jima battle pack. So that was a quick look into these uh, new battle packs from DVG for Warfighter. And I can't wait to have a go at these. Newly arrived in the UK, I believe. The US have had them for a little while, so I'm pleased we've got hold of ours at long last. For this Kickstarter, I only ordered the World War II battle packs, so I can't show you any of the, the other types, but there'll be another video or two quickly showing you the other goodies I got in the Kickstarter. So, hope that was of use and you enjoyed it. And if you did, please consider subscribing, clicking the old like button of the video, Push the bell if you want to be informed of when I upload other content. Share and comment. As I say, it all helps. And a big thank you to those who have already subscribed, my lovely subscribers. Thank you very much indeed. And if you like what I do and you want to support the channel, well, now you can. You can buy me a coffee. It doesn't cost much. And it all goes into a little pot to help me to continue to upload content for the channel. So, there we go. I wonder what we'll get in the next battle packs I'll show you. So, as always, until then, you take care and goodbye.